Hey everybody, the Bonga's back. Welcome to part 119 of Let's Play Dynasty Warriors 4, brought to you by GameAnyone.com. Now this weapon is for the custom Reaper, and nobody suggested this one except for myself. So you gotta go to the Yellow Turban Menace Han forces. Yeah, as you can tell, like the five custom weapons are actually in pretty much the earliest part of the game. So let's get started. Okay, so again, I don't need any officers because it would be too easy otherwise. Rapiers are not very strong, so she will get six item slots to join the likes of Pong Tong, Juga Liang, and Sumai. So, the officers you have to defeat aren't there yet. They're the ambush forces. Insufferable rogues. So basically, we just gotta speed things along by when the gate will open quickly. We will wipe out the enemy at the west gate. Do not fall behind Sun Zhang. Our forces will engage the enemy at the east gate. They shall learn the might of our army. We will attempt to open the south gate. I always find it weird that it's coming full circle. I mean, this is the very first map we played in, like, part one of this Let's Play. Only I was on the Wu forces at the time. Things are a little bit different, because now we're here well just done. to get a weapon. Now head straight for the enemy commander. And back then, I didn't even have any items, let alone a horse. I had to steal horses from enemies. Even on a hard mode, if you build your character up, these enemies are just a breeze. So by taking out enemies on two sides of the gate, or crossing that bridge over there on the Northwest River, will allow Huang Fu Song to be ambushed eventually. There we go! Perfect! So now everything should come along smoothly. So, I'll just head into Xia Pi Castle to wait. Eh, that can wait, Cao Cao. And once I get the weapon, I beeline for Zhang Liang. And it's a good thing I have a wind scroll, because rapiers are very short range. Like, without the wind scroll, I probably would not be able to hit that box on my horse. Report. Enemy soldiers have appeared from the mist. Okay, so the first officer you have to defeat to get the weapon is He Yi. And he should be around here. Oh, there he is. Fun fact, in Act 1, or like the Yellow Turban Act, so to speak, He Yi is actually in every map. Like, he's the only Yellow Turban officer that shows up in all three acts, or three missions of that act. Little fun fact, which I'm pretty sure nobody cares about. But it is very interesting at the same time. Because no other officers are there like more than twice. At least that's what I recall. Okay, so far so good. If I can keep these enemies away from Wang Fu Song, he'll actually be ambushed by Yan Zheng much sooner. Like, as soon as he gets out of the castle, he's gonna be ambushed. That's what I want. So once he's ambushed, then I can go for the kill. The only way you can screw this up is if somebody else steals your kill. Which can't happen, because the enemies are quite weak. Is there any other enemies? I don't think so. There might be like one or two. There we go. I think that's the last of them. In all likelihood. So they should be coming along on this side of the castle. I'll just have to wait for the ambush. I'll just kill some random soldiers for no reason while that happens. As soon as he pops up, bam, there it is. Alright, Yan Zhang, you're mine. As you can tell, this Muso practically sucks. Unless you actually hit the enemy. But it has a nice finish. Sally, that's the only good part of it. Okay, new Waz Rapier has been unlocked. 
And it's always going to be named that. It's not going to be named after Billy Joe if you name your rapier officer Billy Joe. It's not going to happen. There you go, buddy. I'm going to help you out a bit. There. Now all I have to do is defeat Zhang Liang and finish the stage. So again, another very short mission. Yeah, might as well just get some dim sum and muso wine just to lengthen things a bit. And you know what? I'll slay that guy as well. Not very strong, but very fast strikes. So that's the advantage of the rapier weapon. It's like weak, but quick. You don't expect it to do a lot of damage. It's really a thrusting weapon rather than a swinging one. Or slashing weapon. Look at the size of this rapier. It's almost taller than her. I mean, look at that blade. I don't know if it makes a difference if I had the wind scroll off or not. I think the wind scroll only takes effect whenever you swing the weapon, not when you're holding it. I could be wrong, though. I don't really pay attention to those very small nuances. Do I still need health? No! Yeah, she's already at max health now. You know, if I wanted to, I can go for those other officers on Su John's side and still finish the stage within 15 minutes. But, meh, not gonna bother. I'll take out Han Xian over to the east. Over right here. That officer is usually very difficult to spot because he's a sub officer. Huh. What a way to go. Can you imagine I was doing those backstabs like right in the butt? You'll have hemorrhoids for life. Okay, so now let's finish this. I'll put you out of your misery, John Leong. Six charge is pretty good for combos as well. Like, you can get up to ten if you manage to hit every single blow. There, just like that, it's over. Hey. I figured after a bunch of hard missions, why not just go for a couple easy ones? Just to lighten things up a bit. Ah, oh, too bad I couldn't upgrade that Vorpal Orb. That would have been so cool. There we go, we actually got a nice bit of blue on the bottom. Really like that color. Like a very slim blade. So, I'm gonna stop the video right here. In the next part, we're gonna get another weapon. See ya, everybody. Thanks for watching.